Yeah, so what is going on guys? Welcome to today's video. And for today's video, as you guys probably know, Trader already said that I'm going to be filming some of his videos, but thank you guys for getting him to 28 subscribers, I think now. But anyway, we are going to be picking up this canyon and buying this canyon that this guy said that he had. Um, I'm not sure... He said it's just by a yellow house, but there's a lot of yellow houses around here. So we're just going to have to go over here and see if we can't find this house. Um, looks like we're not going to be able to go up on here, so we're going to turn around. And hopefully these people don't mind that I'm riding on the, uh, the, riding on the grass, doing a little bit of damage on the grass. But he said a yellow house, so I'm not sure what he means because there's a lot of yellow houses, but I think I'm going to make a right here and I don't know, I don't know if it's right here, I see a canyon here, he said it was a camo wrap, I don't know if this one has a camo wrap at all or not. This one looks like it does have a white camo wrap, and that's what I meant to say. But I think this is it. Let me um, let me get out and go see what it looks like. Um, looks like it's in good uh, condition. Um, it's got some snorkel on the front. Uh, it looks like the person has left. So. Uh, let me uh, check out the inside of this. Looks pretty good. Um, Canyon logo, right? Not Canyon logo, just it says Canyon right there. Um, looks pretty good. Um, I'm going to get this loaded up on the trailer, and I'll catch you guys then. All right, now guys, we did end up getting this trailer attached. Um, it took a little hassle, as you can see all my marks here, but, um, we got it on, and we're gonna go test this thing out in some mud, so I'm not quite sure, let me, um, we could go to the motocross track and test it out there, but... Yeah, I think we're going to go to the motocross track. So, I'm just not going to bore you guys with this long trip to the motocross track. So, we're just going to catch you guys when we're there. So, we have made it to the motocross track here. I'm going to get this thing off of the trailer now. And we're going to test this thing out on this motocross track here. Um, I'm pretty sure we already did a video on the dirt bikes on the motocross track. If you guys didn't check that out, then make sure you do repair it real quick. It looks like he did a bit of a uh, jumping and stuff with it, so the suspension's pretty good for it. Um, haven't really tested out jumping yet. Ooh, I need a locker in. Nope. Um... Yeah, he said that he took it, like, jump, jumping and stuff, so I'm not sure. I did take it to the shop on my way to the motocross track, just off camera, and um, we got it all tuned up a little bit, so it's running good now. Um, it needed a little, uh, needed just a little mo motor work, you know, so... We checked everything on it, and everything looked good, so we're off on the motocross track now, performing really good. I'm actually surprised we cased that jump pretty much. Um, maybe we'll have to do a motocross video, another one, on side-by-sides versus side-by-sides, or dirt, ooh, <laughs> case is it bad, or side-by-sides, -side. sorry, side just burp there, but side by side versus um, dirt bike, who knows. Let me um, end the video off with this jump right here. I feel like we can make this, we did a hard case on it. 
try to get going 50 here. Looks like we're going to barely clear it there. Hit the step up. Almost endos, but we are okay. We did endo, but we almost went over the, uh, we almost rolled her there. But it looks like they performed really well. Um, so I feel like that's just going to end it off for today. And see you guys on the next video.